Alright you guys, so I ended up paying $3 for my food. It actually was $12. <laughs> but this is my first time witnessing it snow since I've been in Utah. And I was very amazed by the snow because I'm from the country. I'm from North Carolina. It doesn't even snow. Like, we don't see snow. All we see is rain. But this complex I was at was very nice. I like how they had everything set up. They also had a pool outside as well. But I'm going to show you guys that later though. But check out the Airbnb that I rented myself out. It was really nice. I just had one issue. The lady was still cleaning when I came in there. And one other major issue was the fact that all of the lights went out in the living room and they would not turn back on. And I purposely got this Airbnb to do a photo shoot. I wasn't able to shoot, but I still had a good experience being here. If you was to ask if I would live here, yeah and no, but only because I just heard a lot of stumping and it was a lot of trash being left outside of people apartments. But other than that, it was nice. I just wish that they had like tall ceiling windows in the bedroom. That would have made it like even more fire because I love windows. <laughs> But yeah, you guys, check out the snow. It's really cool, right? And I was in love with this view. You can't really see the mountains from over here, but seeing the billboard and the buildings, it was still cool. I just was in love with the snow. It really didn't even snow all day like I thought it would. I think the snow kind of stopped like around 7 p.m., if I'm not mistaken. And Utah's time zone is different from North Carolina time zone. We're like two hours behind. So, yeah. It didn't take me a hard time getting adjusted to the time either. But yeah, you guys, I finally made it into this area. At first, I couldn't get in because I didn't have the key. But this area was really nice. It's like a little lounge area. And I had said I was gonna take pictures in here as well, but I didn't. I should've though, but they closed everything up at a certain time. I had honestly let people in the pool because I think the pool closed like at 10. I was the only one in there and I had let some residents in the pool because they couldn't get in because the scanners stopped working at a certain time. But other than that, the building was nice. I really did love the snow. It was so beautiful being in the snow. Even though it was snowing, it wasn't that cold though. And I still ended up getting in the jacuzzi. I would have gotten a jacuzzi while it was snowing just to get the experience, but I had to do other things, you know? But make sure you guys like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think about these views though, because this is really nice. You guys don't really see me post content like this because I'm never in the snow. Like, I'm either in the sun, I'm either by the beach, or I'm either at home or traveling. But, like, I know you guys don't usually see me post snow, but you guys will see me posting snow content a lot more. Okay, so, yeah, stay tuned for that one. Alright YouTube. Alright YouTube, what's up? This is your girl in New York and I'm back with another video. You know what I'm saying? Excuse my hair or whatever. I was trying to like blow dry it or whatever because it got puffy and wet. Y'all know I'm natural so you know what I'm saying? I did my little edges a little bit but right now I'm in Utah. Um I just left Lehigh, Utah, and now I'm in Salt Lake City, Utah. 
Um, this isn't my first time being in Salt Lake City, Utah, but this is my first time being downtown in the condo and I can say that it's really nice, you know what I'm saying? I kind of had like a little issue when I first checked in because they were still cleaning it or whatever. But other than that, you know what I'm saying? Everything is nice. Check out the views. Um, I wanted to do this video earlier, but I was on OnlyFans and I was making money. So I didn't want to leave because the money didn't want to stop coming in. You know what I'm saying? So the money finally stopped coming in. So I finally was able to do this video for you guys. All right, so um, this is going to be a wig review. You know what I'm saying? Let me back up some. But this is going to be a wig review. You know what I'm saying? I ordered a wig off Amazon. It's like a color that I always wanted to try. And I'm supposed to be shooting tonight as well. So, yeah. I'm going to give y'all like a room tour, house tour with my face in the camera. Even though my stuff is on the counter, I'm going to just show y'all around or whatever. But um, my experience in Utah, since I've been here, I've been here for like two weeks. Going on three weeks, it has, it has changed tremendously. I've been making a lot of money. Like, I've been making more money than I made at home because I moved out of my apartment. I'm not sure if you guys know, but I moved out of my apartment in December. And I went to go be with my family um in january and february but yeah you guys um my memory was full or whatever but yeah you guys um my memory was kind of full or whatever but i'm back you know what i'm saying but like i was saying um my stay in utah has been lovely you know i've been making a lot of money since i've been here more money than i was making when i was at home with my family so that's a really good thing and i'm feeling my hair like this and i also want to get in a jacuzzi too so i'm probably going to go to walmart or either target and get a swimsuit because i want to get in the water i'm probably i think i'm better off going to target than going to walmart though because last time i went to walmart they didn't have no swimsuits in the worth nothing so i think i need to go to target because they probably have a better option for me because i want to get in the jacuzzi the jacuzzi closes at 10 so i definitely want to get in the water it's not snowing outside anymore so i think it'll be a good idea to get in the water but my phone, um, my nail about to break. I so I supposed to be shooting tonight, and I also supposed to be reviewing this wig for you guys as well. But I'm wearing my natural hair. I don't usually do this, you know. I had to do the little edges or whatever. My edges been growing back on both sides, though, so like for real. But yeah, I got another wig. I'm about to get it so you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. But now I really been thinking about moving. <laughs> like it's like my like my my supporters, my fans, my followers, whatever they want to call themselves, whatever you want to refer them to, or you are whoever you know. They like they be saying different stuff. Like if I'm on OnlyFans Live and I be like, "Oh, you guys think I should move here?" They be like, "Go with your intuition." And if you're having good luck over there, then you know, do that, do this. And then when I go live on Instagram, they be like, "Nah, too many white people and it's too many days." And you like they just, it just be crazy for you. Yeah, um, as I was saying, because my um, for some reason my memory is like. For some reason though, my memory is like so full, so like the camera keeps stopping by itself. But um, I'm going to go ahead and get the wig so you guys can um, see it. I ordered it from Amazon. It came the next day and I'm going to be wearing it because I'm going to do a photo shoot tonight. But I kind of want to do a photo shoot in my real hair too though. Like I'm feeling my real hair for some reason. I'm feeling it like this. My mama told me to wear my hair like this one time before, but I never did it though. But I might like take some pictures and it would look cute like this. But let me go get the wig though for you guys so y'all can see. It's time to get in the water. See, I could have brought my ring light out here and everything. I should go back and get it for real. 
That's what I get it. I ordered this package off of Amazon. You know what I'm saying? I got me a lingerie set and a wig, but I'm only going to be reviewing the wig, okay? So, here goes nothing. All right, so this wig is beauty and love and youth, 100% human hair so it's BLY stands for beauty and love and youth all right we always provide you with the best quality products thanks for choosing BLY hair so before I got this I really looked at the reviews before I got this wig all right so I'm gonna open it which way should I open it I'm gonna open it this way and I still mess up the lot Pull it out. I have to be careful because this nail is kind of broke. I'm gonna pull it out. Okay. All right. So um, when I was looking at the reviews and the pictures, the wig kind of looks a little lighter than it does on um, the pictures they have, but. As always, you know, per usual, they gave me some lashes, some 3D mink hair lashes. More, I'm probably not going to wear these, but they gave them to me. They're okay. 3D mink hair lashes or whatever. Um, here's the wig cap. You feel me? And here's the wig. It's kind of darker than the color that I was just wearing. It's actually brown. I didn't really want this color. I wanted a lighter color, but damn, it looks like the mouths need to be bleached too. But I'm not bleached so. Let's see what it is. We're gonna see. Oh, okay, it's not that dark. It's not that dark, but it's cute. Um, it's a 20 inch deep wave honey brown wig. You know what I'm saying? I never tried this color before, so I'm excited to try it on my head. I'm gonna put the wig on my head as well so you guys can see what it looks like on me. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to get my eyebrows to match this wig, but we can always try, right? Um, I wish I would have had a long curler, but I mean, it's okay. It feels really soft though. It feels really soft. Um, let me know in the comments what y'all think about this wig. So far, I like it. Let me remove these. Let me remove these. Let me remove these. Okay. And it has a band. I'm probably gonna remove it because I have a big head. The bands, the bands on the wig tend to be like extremely tight. And I don't like when my wig is extremely tight, it's okay my head. I like to be able to breathe. But it's cute though, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of thin a little bit, but we're gonna see. The wig was very cheap, so like, um, I don't expect for it to like, you know, be the way I want it. But I'm gonna put my hair in a ponytail and I'm gonna try this wig on. So I'll be right back. 